actually gives us a lot of confidence that the health of the craft will be very good. We will be able to continue with the experiments, including the Pragyan rover coming out and then doing all the experiments. Very, very exciting 14 days from now for Chandrayaan 3. And all of you know it is not an easy task at all. Uh, it's a work of last so many years. Maybe for Chandrayaan 3 it's a work of last four years, but for Chandrayaan 2 that was a work of many years back. And uh, the learning that we got from Chandrayaan 2 of uh, our unsuccessful attempt to soft, soft land has really helped us in perfecting the, uh, the methodology and also to have large number of experiments plus to prove the process of landing and it has paid dividends today and we had a very soft landing and it actually achieved most of the nominal conditions for the landing including the velocity of touchdown in fact i didn't get it exactly possibly my team will be able to tell them uh, the, ex the velocity was far less than two meter per second it actually gives us a lot of confidence that the health of the craft will be very good and we will be able to continue with the experiments including the pragyan rover coming out and then doing all the experiments so we are looking for the very very exciting 14 days from now for Chandrayaan 3 and as Honorable Prime Minister has mentioned it is not Chandrayaan 3 alone it is for future scientific exploratory missions this is the beginning of uh, a golden era that's that is a message I get from what our Prime Minister told <clears throat> so we are looking for launch of Aditya L1 now next month and also the launches of many other science missions including the mission for the human space flight as well so thanking each one of you for your support and I cannot tell you the type of uh, uh, the, the excitement that is created in the whole of India. Every school child, every school, every village, every mohalla is excited by the shock, showcasing of this uh, landing videos and broadcast. And all of them are praying, having a lot of pujas and homas and other methods of prayers suitable for each one of them to, for the success of this mission. And I want to thank each one of you for your your excitement, your love for the nation and for whatever we achieved today. It's all dedicated to your, uh, yourself and for your courage and strength to support us.